Welcome back to Plus Trending on Plus TV Africa. Remember, you can join the conversation. Say something. Send your comments to us on WhatsApp or drop your comments on Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram using the hashtag Plus Trending, and I will find your comments. Okay? Mm -hmm. Next up is Governor Wiki of River State. He's actually very hot on the trend map this week because of some radical things he's doing to help reduce the interstate spread and protect his state and people from the dreaded coronavirus. Most parts of the states are actually currently on lockdown. And as the governor is doing all he can to ensure strict adherence, people are actually also supporting him within the state from what I hear. First off, the governor has ordered the prosecution of 14 persons caught moving cattle from Adama State into Portacot while with, well, with the charges being the breach of river state border closure and lockdown. Wiki has also ordered the auction of the cattle impounded <laughs> and two trucks which they were being conveyed in after they were intercepted. He went on to ask the Ministry of Health to conduct tests on these 14 people to ascertain their coronavirus status. Oh, but that's not all people. One of those arrested actually claimed he paid 1,500 naira to a security agent to help grant them access into the state despite the lockdown. This made the governor very, very angry as he accused a deputy commissioner of police in the state of sabotaging the lockdown imposed. And now the governor himself is out on the streets monitoring the lockdown himself. <laughs> At Ogbe Mindikpo says, Wiki's type of madness is occasionally necessary to deal with critical situations in Nigeria. Loads of stubborn, ignorant people, corrupt security officials. It is a mess. Okay, so now let's see more comments and reactions from social media. Our final trending topic today is a really, really interesting one, okay? Yeah. Former governor of Abia State, Oji Uzokalo, is once again a free man. Yes, he was sentenced to 12 years in prison. No, he hasn't been gone for that long. Yes, yes, yes. He is once again a free man. You want to know how? How? I'll tell you. The Supreme Court on Friday, the 8th of May, nullified the conviction of the former governor Oji Uzokalo. Senator Kalu was convicted of a 7.65 billion naira fraud perpetrated when he was Abia state governor. That was between 1999 to 2007. But the senator argued that the court of appeal judge who delivered the judgment leading to his 12-year jail sentence lacked the power to do so. And then the Supreme Court, of course, backed up his argument. Are there reactions to this story? <laughs> of course there are. I mean, it's still a developing story, yeah? But Nigerians are already reacting online. Now, let's check out their comments.
And that's our show for today. Thanks for joining me on this episode of Plus Trending. Please tune in to Plus TV Africa on DSTV channel 408 or visit our social media pages and of course subscribe to our YouTube channel at Plus TV Africa for more trending topics. My name is Buki November, reminding you to make every day count. <laughs>